everyone. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to transfer uh, your content from your PC or Mac uh, to your PS Vita uh, using the Content Manager Assistant. So what you need to, get, uh, to do to get started is open up the Content Manager Assistant on your computer, like so. Um, it will look different for the uh, PC of course, but what you need to do is wherever you can access the preferences um, on a Mac it's on the uh, status bar and you go to preferences like so there uh, now once you have this open you need to specify where you want the PS Vita to access the content that you want to transfer so say the photos it will be in the pictures folder of the computer the videos will be in the movie section uh, music will be in music, of course, and applications slash backup files will be in the documents uh, in the PS Vita folder. And sorry about that, my computer's fan has started up very loud for some reason. So, hopefully you guys can still hear me. Um, anyway, and then the save data for the PSP system will be located in the documents PS Vita uh, slash PS a uh, piece saved uh, data so there you go and then yeah once you configure that you can start your content manager on the PS Vita system uh, then one more thing uh, if you need to you can rebuild your database for the PS Vita but I don't need to do that so but yeah once you configure this you need to go to the PS Vita system and start the transfer so uh, once you're done with there click OK so I will be back in just a sec um, to show you guys how to transfer the content actually using the PS Vita system on Content Manager. So, yes, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back here. So now that you have set up or configured your Content uh, Manager Assistant on your computer, uh, the next step we need to do, or that you need to do in doing this process is uh, plugging in your PS Vita to uh, your computer through the USB cable, of course. And once you do that, uh, the computer will recognize that the PS Vita is connected and the content manager will be uh, activated. And on the PS Vita system, what you need to do is turn it on. Uh, click on content manager. Go ahead and start it up. And it has now recognized that I am connected to a PC, or as in this case a Mac, but it doesn't particularly know that, but it doesn't matter. But it says I'm connected. And for this, we are going from PC to PS Vita system. And you also could do PS Vita to PC, but that's not what this point of the video is. So let's go ahead and hit PC to PS Vita system. Now it's going to let me act access all the information that I previously uh, was showing you guys on the computer in the preferences so for this demo I'm going to well not demo but for this um, particular part of the video I'm going to transfer a song from the p uh, computer to the PS Vita so let's hit that it's going to switch over to the music app uh, the same it's basically the same exact process as you do with the PS3 um, just that you're connecting it to a PC or Mac. I mean, it doesn't at all matter. Uh, just is exactly the same, basically. So, <clears throat> <clears throat> sorry, I'm kind of losing my voice a little bit. Anyway, so, any of these songs, I can go ahead and just pick whichever one I want. Um, let me go ahead and find one that I don't already have on the PS Vita already. Uh, let's see. Let me go... Down to the G's. Real quick. Where is the G? Quite a long list here. Sorry about this. Okay, here's the G's. Um, okay, here's the one that's not already on the PS Vita. So, what you need to do now is check mark it. Hit copy. It says the PS Vita. Or the selected, why did I say that? The selected content, uh, 
items will now be copied to the PS Vita system memory card. If you want to say OK, hit OK. It says the battery's low, it's just going to warn you about that, but it'll still allow you to do it, so hit yes. It's going to copy the song. And it'll take a just a few seconds. And there we go, it's starting to speed up now. And it is done, so let me back out of this and go into Recently Added. And there's the song, now in my PS Vita's music library. So, now I'm going to try to transfer a video. That I actually haven't tried yet with the computer. Okay, it has one thing, and it's Idiocracy. That's a movie that I have. Um, it is an hour and 30 minutes, basically, so I'm not going to copy that, because that would take a very, very long time to transfer. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and skip that. I'm going to try and actually transfer a photo now. <clears throat> okay, the camera is running out of battery. Hopefully I can get this going. Okay, transfer, copy, just like normal. It's going to ask you about the battery. And it's going to transfer the thing, or the photo. Why did I say thing? I don't know. <laughs> anyway. And there you go. For some reason, it's saying these two are corrupted. That's kind of odd. Oh well. But anyway, you guys get it? That's how it works from PC to PSV to transferring. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I hope you, I helped you guys out. Um, I'm going to go and zoom out now. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hit the subscribe button right there. Thumbs up the video. And uh, comment below if you have any questions. Um, if, yeah, if you have any questions, comment below. I will be sure to answer your questions. So, yes, thank you very much for watching. Peace.